A terrifying attack on a Lyft driver, and it is caught on a dash cam. The driver tells us a passenger sexually assaulted her as they were driving on a San Jose freeway. Here's NBC Barry's Stephanie Magallon. It starts like every other eerie scene. A late drive Monday night on a silent freeway. <coughs> and then heart-wrenching screams. <coughs> The cries and panic last for about 30 seconds. You're not gonna die. At one point, you can hear someone say, you're not going to die right now. The driver pulls over and dash cam footage catches her running into traffic on San Jose's 280 southbound near 10th Street, pleading for help. Please help me, please help me, gritando, chorando. With help from an interpreter, Zelia Silva tells me she was working for Lyft that night, and the man that attacked her was a customer. She says she was driving 70 miles an hour when she suddenly felt his arms wrap around her. Ele me mobilizou, prendendo os meus braços. He immobilized me, says Silva, who remembers him pinning her so hard against her seat, she was holding the steering wheel with her fingertips, all while trying to park the car and kick the door open to escape. Tô com um hematoma. Leaving bruises and marks around her chest and wrist. Please drive, por favor, por favor, drive. Por favor. Silva tells us the driver who picked her up saved her life. She believes the passenger wanted to kill her. After safely getting into another car on the freeway, you can hear the suspect yell, and then the car is on the move. He exits on 10th Street, ignores several red lights, and swerves through the city streets until crashing into a light pole. In a statement, Lyft says it's offering support to the driver and permanently removing the rider account from the Lyft community. But Silva says more needs to be done. A Lyft não permite que nós tenhamos câmera para dentro do carro. She wants cameras inside of her car. She demands female drivers have the choice of only picking up female passengers and asks Lyft to prohibit riders from requesting pickups for others, which is what she says happened here. A woman requested a ride for the man she says sexually violated her. A suspect who police say is still on the run. In San Jose, Stephanie Magallon, NBC Bay Area News.